In the Midlands and especially Birmingham, you're never far from a rat. So not surprisingly, Birmingham is the place in the UK that makes the most calls to pest control experts like Carl Richards. So what are these holes? Is this the side of a rat? These are a rat burrows, um, which uh, is typical of a, quite a fairly size infestation. Traditional traps entice the rats in with poison bait, but there's no way to control the amount they eat or the dose of poison they get. The problem is in some parts of the country, rats are becoming resistant to the poisons we use to kill them, and they're passing that resistance on to their offspring. We're looking at a new generation of poison-resistant super rats. Scientists worry it's going to take more and more poison to do the job, and that poses problems. We're putting more poison there to actually kill, kill the rats that, that are freely roaming in these areas. Um, and you just often don't notice that there's that massive amount of poison hidden in a little black box at the side of the road or the side of your house. But at the University of Aston, they're working on a completely new type of rat trap that avoids all these problems. Our rat trap works by spraying the rats um, with, a, with a toxin. So un, unlike normal traps, they don't have to eat this poison. They're actually dosed with it, so they receive one fixed dose, um, and they go on to die from that poison at a, a later time. The rat enters the trap and breaks a laser beam that allows an inbuilt computer to work out how big the rat is and the precise dose of poison to spray directly onto the skin of the rat to kill it. It's not just Birmingham and the Midlands, of course. Worldwide, rats are a huge problem, carrying disease and damaging crops. So a new form of rat control will bring real benefits for everyone. David Gregory Kumar, BBC News, Birmingham.